morning and welcome to London. So I'm here today for the uh, launch of BBC 10 Pieces and BBC 10 Pieces is um, BBC 10 Pieces opens up the world of classical music to 7 to 14 year olds, introducing them to inspiring music and empowering them to make their own creative responses. So it's a whole teaching system, uh, I think there's usually a prom that goes with it as well, uh, and today they launch their brand new year, all their new pieces, and you're coming along as well. Um, also we need to get the scooter on because we're running a little bit late. But, that's the Royal Opera House over there. So here we are. Just look at this place. It is huge. It's so time to go inside, find out what's going on. Yeah, looking forward to it. Classical music could be so good. Open your ears. Let's go. Well, good morning, everyone. Good morning. My name is Naomi Wilkinson. I am delighted to be here with you all today. It's been an absolute joy for me to be involved in the Ten Pieces project. I've been presenting films, hosting schools concerts, and a lifelong dream. I got to share the stage of the Royal Albert Hall with some amazing musicians and young performers, and even a firebird. Um, as someone who is passionate about education and music, and like Catherine, I grew up in a musical family too. I was once upon a long ago a French horn player, now an occasional piano player, but this project is so important to me. And I've seen up close just how inspirational it is for many, many children. So that's why Ten Pieces is going to celebrate works and composers that throughout history have opened our ears to new sound worlds. These are ten people and ten pieces that shook up the musical world and broke new ground. <coughs> and so this new selection of music is called Ten Pieces Trailblazers. Hi, so I'm here with Naomi, who's one of the BBC Ten Pieces uh, presenters. What's your new or like your pieces that you're looking forward to or forward to the most? Ah, uh, there's so many good ones in the new Trailblazers. Um, I really am looking forward to the response from the children to Steve Reich, the music for 18 musicians, because I was introduced to a piece of this music when I was at school doing my GCSE music, and it was not the piece that we've got now, but it was another one, and I loved it, and I can't tell you how many times I've listened to it since. So I hope you all love that one. Um, and then Johan Brahms, Hungarian Dance Number no. 5. I, I love that one. One of my well. favourites as well. It's proper, makes you just want to dance, so... They're probably my two favourites, but yeah, I like a lot of them. Amazing, and you might not be able to say the answer, but will you be presenting in summer at one of the proms again? I really, I don't know if we've got a prom this year. I don't know, I haven't heard yet. Fingers crossed. Let's hope so. Uh, I think it's amazing to see um, National Youth Orchestra Scotland playing in the Steve Reich. It'll be really exciting to see the film for that. And uh, it was really cool to see Stephanie Childress, who was a previous NYA leader. Um, playing the Four Seasons, uh, and they're all great trailblazers, so look forward to seeing the film. Mm. Coffee is so, so overdue. But yeah, had a really, really good time today. Lots of really interesting stuff going on. Um, most exciting one, I'm going to quickly run through the pieces, Hans Zimmer Earth, which is going to be really, really fascinating. He's one of the biggest composers on Earth right now, and if you don't know him, you will know his films, because he's done literally everything like these. That's absolutely amazing. Sadly, he wasn't there today because that would be incredibly cool getting him over from Hollywood or something, I guess. But the other ones are George Gershwin, Rhapsody in Blue, uh, Ravi Shankar, Symphony Finale, uh, Delia Derbyshire, Doctor Who theme, uh, Antonio Vivaldi, Winter Four Seasons, um, one I will now ruin the pronunciation of, which is Gretchen Basevich Overture. 
Let me know how I actually supposed to say that. Um, Steve Reich, Music for 18 Musicians. Villa Lobos, back in Irish, Artist number two. Uh, Florence Price Symphony Overture. Uh, Florence Price Symphony number one. And Brahms Hungarian Dance number five. Um, it's a really cool set of pieces. One thing that I love is that the stuff that I have no idea what it is. Um, so the base of it, Joe Jaw, I have never heard before. Florence Price Symphony, I don't know at all either. Um, so I'm really looking forward to hearing what they're like and what people do with them as well as part of the 10 pieces. But also some of my favorite stuff on there as well. So the, the Brahms Hungarian Dance is one that I've known since being tiny, which I absolutely love. Uh, Vivaldi Four Seasons as well. It's such an incredible piece of music and so emotive and uh, one that everyone will recognize. Uh, yeah, and then also stuff like the Doctor Who theme and getting to, to recognize people like Delia Derbyshire who people don't know. Some random music going on there. So I'm currently hiding at the, the Royal Opera House uh, to record this a little bit. And they keep doing these little announcements about the performance starting, which is absolutely surreal. That is literally the longest announcement to say that you need to go to, to sit down. But I'm currently hiding at the Royal Opera House and it is literally the most phenomenal view. Check out this. Look at that, it's amazing. But yeah, really good day. Um, really excited to see what BBC 10 Pieces is gonna be like. Uh, if you wanna to get to know anything about it, either if you wanna be a teacher and get involved, or if you want to uh, listen to any of the pieces, put a link in the description, and yeah. I think that's the end of the vlog. Bye bye.